Hi everybody, it's Mina. Welcome back to my channel, or if this is the very first video that you're seeing of me, then welcome to my channel. Please be sure to hit the subscribe button down below if you didn't already. I post every day of the week for all, and I apologize for the noise. If you hear barking, that is Mr. Pickles. So anyway, today in this video, I'm going to tell you guys a story about how I ru accidentally rudely rushed my hairdresser. So this is a story just to teach you guys never rush like your hairdresser when they're cutting your hair because they're doing you a favor by helping you out by doing your appointment for you and it's never good to really rush somebody unless you have um places you need to be which i which you understand which they understand but it's always just good to be considerate because they're doing you a favor by cutting your hair so i'm going to get started and let me know if you guys have accidentally done that before and I felt bad that I did it but I glad but I'm very glad that I learned not to do that so I'm gonna get started so this all started when I was in the fourth grade um I wanted to get my hair cut because I got tired of taking care of it and the same day I was getting my hair cut I was going to a birthday party for a very good friend of mine and so I went so I had my hair cut yeah so my hair cutting appointment was on a Sunday which is the same day as my friend's birthday party party which she invited me to so I went to like from I went to I think it was Oakland or something I don't remember and I knew this lady because she was friends with my mom and she cut my and she did my mom's hair for her and she owned and she owned her own salon so she was very nice to offer to cut my hair for me so we get there and it's like a few minutes before I have to go like a half hour or some like I think half hour before I have to go to a, the birthday party and so she's cutting my hair and then it's like kind of like almost like near the time I have to be at the party party and she's like not even done cutting my hair and it's taking her a while to cut my hair and I was like are you almost finished and I was just trying to be polite about it and she's like yes I'm almost done done blah 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 and she blah and she goes well uh, and she still keeps cutting my hair and I was like are you almost done and I'm kind of starting to get impatient which I hate being impatient she goes wait I'm almost done and then my mom was trying to explain to the hairdresser that I had to go to a birthday party that day and she felt and the um and we were kind of already late and she and my hairdresser felt really bad that and she's like okay um I'm almost done it did take her quite a while but I felt bad for getting impatient because she was doing me a favor and I was accidentally rushing her because I was trying to get to a birthday party so I could get there in time because I was already like five minutes late for the birthday party and so once these after a while she's done like cutting my hair and I'm very pleased with it because I thought it looked very very nice Nice, and then I apologized to my hairdresser for rushing her. Her and she um, was very forgiving, and she said that's okay. I'm so sorry that I took so much time into it, time, and if I made you late for your party, and I was like, that's okay. I forgave her, and so, but I actually came to the party in time. I wasn't. Um, I wasn't exactly late. Um, we kind of left quickly right after she was finished. And then um, I came to the party like right on time and I was very happy I got there like right when everybody arrived. And when I walked in, nobody at the party recognized me from my um, short hair. hair. And they're like, Mina, is that you? Blah, 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 blah. Cause they were all used to me with long hair at the time because I had hair down to the middle down to my bottom and I cut it that day and I was everybody like nobody knew but he recognized me because they were all so used to me with long hair <laughs> hair which was very very um interesting thing because I had never cut my hair short at the time I always had it long long ever since I was a kid kid and I had it to get it cut because I wanted to get it cut because I got tired of having trouble taking care of it so it made it much easier so easier and then the next day I see my hairdresser I apologize to her for rushing her to get my hair done and she's like that is okay I'm very sorry I sorry I it took me so long to cut your hair and she was very polite about it and she was very forgiving too which I was happy happy and then we did 
happy and I was very happy that she forgave me and I even though I did feel bad for rushing her. So the moral of the story is if somebody's doing a, you a favor by cutting your hair for you, please always remember not to rush people because it is kind of rude because they are doing you a favor. I literally felt bad that I was rushing my hairdresser to cut my hair because I was already running late for a birthday party that day. But I'm glad she was very nice and understanding and forgave me for rushing her because it is really rude to rush people when they're doing you a favor. Favor and favor and um, it's good to be considerate of others because sometimes things take a while like haircuts and stuff, but also remember to plan them them like a couple an hour, a couple hours or so depending on how long they take before you go to things. I think mine was an hour before my party started, so I was already running late for my party. I was almost late for my party, but I felt really bad that I rushed my hairdresser, but I'm glad she forgave me. So that was a story about how I accidentally rushed my haircut. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope this taught you to always be considerate and not rush people when they're doing you a favor, favor because they're being they're considerate of their time for you. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. I post every day of the week for all, and I'll see you very soon. Bye.